In this tutorial, we use linking properties to create animation where the character carrying weapon or object. And I'll use the animation from my previous tutorial, but first I'll delete animation from arms and hands. Next, I'll create object and I'll use bone because I can attach weapon model later and it's easier to export animation to the game engine since I will animate bone instead mesh. Next, we need to place bone object in the biped hand. Turn on auto key, select, rotate and pose biped hand to hold bone object. Look at the hand from different angles to ensure that it's gripping bone object. Don't be considered about finger passing through the bone a bit. You can adjust this later when you add your actual poly mesh. So make adjustment to the hand, rotate fingers. Next we need to link the object or our bone to the hand. So select the bone, go to motion panel, linking and Set up link constraint. Click OK. Go to add link button and select the hand. And now when you play the animation, the object will follow the hand. But let's say we want an animation where biped holding the weapon or the object with both hands. So let's start by setting up pose and position the second hand on the object. Again, rotate hands, arms and fingers. So now we need to link the other hand. But first let me copy and paste some animation. So I have a nice cycle. Now let's go back to the first frame. Select our hand. And go to key info and set up planted key. And then go to key infos again. But this time go to IK. And click the little arrow and select object. Click yes, that's okay. And set the key again. So when you play the animation, now the second hand follows the object. Now you can make adjustment to the animation very fast by adjusting position of the first hand or the weapon. Thank you.